Yo, what up boys? In this video, I'll be showing you guys the top 5 best no-risk $1 trade-ups that you can do right now and one bonus one at the end, so make sure to check that one out. Now, in my opinion, the best trade-up that you can do if you have less than a dollar is this trade-up over here. So this will be an industrial-grade bank trade-up in where you'll be using 10 field-tested bank skins. So you can use either the Glock Death Rattle or the GSG-G1 Green Apple and you can get them for around 7 cents each and the average float of the 10 skins needs to be less than 0 0.1875. Now the total cost will be around 70 cents and for the outcomes, the best outcome will be the Deagle Meteorite which will be a 40 cents profit. Then the two other outcomes will be profits anywhere from 3 to 8 cents. Now you may think that these profits are very small but considering that you only put 70 cents in, these are some insane profits as a profitable is over 124.29% and it is also a no-risk trade-up so that is really nice and make sure to try this one out. Now for trade-up number 2, I will recommend you guys to do this mil-spec Spectrum 2 trade-up. So you'll be using 10 minimal worth Spectrum 2 skins and you can use the SCAR 20, the GSG G1, and the Sod of Morris which you can get for around 11 to 12 cents each and the average float of the 10 skins needs to be less than 0 0.0972. Now the total cost will be around $1.12 each and for the outcomes, again as I said this is a no risk trade up. So we will get the 30 cents profit with the MP9 or the CZ, then around an 11 to 14 cents profit with the rest of the outcomes so this is a really nice trade up. And I forgot to tell you guys but the inputs for this trade up is quite easy to get as you can see over here. So if you want the trade up to spam, make sure to check this one out. Now for trade up number 3, we will be doing a mil spec recall trade up in where we will be using 6 field tested recall skins and 4 minimal wear recall skins. So you can use any of the skins that I am showing over here and you can get the field tested skins for 5 cents each and the minimal wear skins for 10 cents each. But the only thing you need to keep in mind is that you need to keep the average float to be below 0.15 so I recommend you guys to use field tested skins with floats less than 0.19 and minimal wear skins with floats less than 0.09. Now the total cost will be around 70 cents and for the outcomes this will be an insanely nice trade up since all of the 5 outcomes cost 97 cents each and the profitability is over 120% so this is really a literal no risk trade up so make sure to try this one out. Are you looking for low float skins for your trade ups? Well, I just found this low float skin for this print stream trade up easily on Skins Monkey. So, Skins Monkey is a site where you can trade your skins safely and easily to get those nasty CS2 skins. And for you guys, Skins Monkey and I are giving out a free $5 on your first trade if you put in my code else. They're also giving away a bunch of free skins, and using my code, you can get a 35% bonus on your deposits. So, make sure to check them out, link is in the description. Now, let's move on to trade up number 4. So this will just be the minimal wear version of the first trade up that I showed. So you'll be using 10 minimal wear industrial grade bank skins and for this trade up you can use the Glock Death Rattle, the GSG G1 Green Apple and the Nova Cage Steel which you can get for around 10 cents each. And now the average float of the 10 skins needs to be less than 0 0.0875. Now for the outcomes, for this trade up, the Galil and the CZ now comes out in factory new so those will be profits anywhere from 10 cents to 24 cents each and the Deagle Meteorite will be still a profit of 10 cents. Now the profitability of this trade up is a bit less than the first trade up, it will only be around 115% but profit is profit so I will take it any time of the day. Now going on to the last trade up before the bonus trade up. A lot of people don't think that they're profitable trade ups under 50 cents, so here is one. So, for this trade up, we will be using 10 field tested industrial grade 2018 Inferno skins. And for this trade up, you can use the Revolver Nitro, the Mac 10 Calf skin, and the Bison Candy Apple, which you can get for 5 cents each. Now, the average float of the 10 skins is less than 0 0.175, and the total cost will be 50 cents each. And for the outcomes, we get an 18 cents profit with the USB check engine, then a 15 cents profit with the M4A4, a 12 cents profit with the sawed off brake light, and a small loss with the SSG handbrake. Now, considering that we only put in 50 cents for this trade up, this trade up is very profitable, and I highly recommend you guys to try this one out. Now, for the last and final trade up for this video, we do need the thumbnail, and putting a $1 skin will not really do good in the YouTube algorithm, so let's do a really nice trade up. 
So this will be a really risky trade up and we'll be using 6 millimore revolution skins and 4 factory new glove skins. Now this is a trade up that I have done in the past and the average float of the 10 skins needs to be less than 0.07 so I recommend you guys to use millimore revolution skins with floats less than 0.093 and factory new glove skins with floats less than 0.035. Now this is a very expensive trade up, it will cost $64 and for the outcomes, we get a $59 profit with the M4A for Temukau, then a break even with the AK headshot and the bid gloss with these two outcomes. So hopefully we don't hit any of those two. So let's try this trade up out in 3, 2, 1. Now anyway, if you want to see how a $1 trade-up made me over $50, make sure to check out this video. Otherwise, peace out boys.